close the evening. Get me Thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen. Coming to our new home, the, the, the new salon's home. Um, I'll close with um, a short vignette. It's part of a series, The Liverpool Memories, and this is number six. Everything's true, of course. <laughs> My husband and I, uh, his name is Martin, uh, went to Liverpool to my mother's funeral. I had got a special Liverpudlian rate in a Victorian converted mansion in Sefton Park and ended up with the over-the-top bridal suite. The ceiling was royal blue with gold twinkling stars and naked white Grecian tacky statues adorning the bathroom. The deal was dinner, bed and breakfast. However, the dinner was poor quality, with everything piled high on one plate, looking and tasting very unappetizing. The dining room was full of international interpreters because across in the park, an emergency camp had been set up for asylum seekers. We retired to bed after consuming a good bottle of red wine to sleep, her chance to dream? Impossible. The double bed was lumpy and we both rolled into the middle of the mattress and had a dreadful sleepless night. The next morning, exhausted for some reason, my magical husband Martin stood up on the bed and decided to jump up and down. Whatever possessed him, there was a resounding crack and the whole bed and mattress tipped down to the base bedhead, releasing clouds of dusty confetti. On examination, two or three of the cheap Ikea-esque wooden struts had broken. Sheepishly, we went down to breakfast, wondering how the manager was going to view our nocturnal excavates. <laughs> well, it was the bridal suite after all. To our amazement, he thanked us profusely for letting him know in time so that the bed could be repaired before an important wedding that very weekend. There would be no charge for anything. Thank God we only stayed one night. <laughs> <laughs> I don't remember the name of the hotel. <laughs> anyway, uh, thank you all for coming. Uh, the next salon is the s Tuesday the 7th of April. And unfortunately, there will be a small charge because I'm being charged. So that's life. But I hope that won't put you off coming. So enjoy the rest of the evening. The, the bar's still open. And in fact, they've got a license till one o'clock oh, for those that want to stay longer. So enjoy the rest of the evening. Thank you for coming.